in this code sample we have the definition for the class student and the definition for the class course then we instantiate course we get a new object instantiated from the class course and its reference is assigned to the variable course after that we instantiate student and we pass over the reference for the course object that we have just created so that stud is assigned with a reference for a student object an object that one of its properties hold a reference for a course object this is a chain of invocations first we refer the property course then the reference course holds course is a property in a student object is a reference for an object where we can access the property name placing the question mark allows us to access the uh, the content of the property course using the question mark we can get the value the course property old when it holds one is course is after all an optional type property if if there is indeed a reference for a course object in the property course then we access the name property and that value is assigned to this constant which is later printed to the screen we could also alternatively access it through this syntax now if we execute this code sample we shall get printed to the screen the name of the course we created